the misanthrope 13. The unjust abhorrence of his name. Lo, my name is abhorred. Lo, more than the odor of birds on summer days when the sky is hot. Lo, my name is abhorred. Lo, more than a fish receiver. On the day of the catch when the sky is hot. Lo, my name is abhorred. Lo, more than the odor of fowl on the willow hill full of geese. Lo, my name is abhorred. Lo, more than the odor of fishermen. By the shores of the marshes when they have fished. Lo, my name is abhorred. Lo, more than the odor of crocodiles. More than sitting under the bank full of crocodiles. Lo, my name is abhorred. Lo, more than a woman. Against whom a lie is told her husband. The corruption of men. To whom do I speak today? Brothers are evil. Friends of today are not of love. To whom do I speak today? Hearts are thievish. Every man seizes his neighbor's goods. To whom do I speak today? The gentleman perishes. The bold faced goes everywhere. To whom do I speak today? He of the peaceful face is wretched. The good is disregarded in every place. To whom do I speak today? When a man arouses wrath by his evil conduct. He stirs all men to mirth, although his iniquity is wicked. To whom do I speak today? Robbery is practiced. Every man seizes his neighbor's goods. To whom do I speak today? The pest is faithful. But the brother who comes with it becomes an enemy. To whom do I speak today? Yesterday is not remembered. Nor is, in this hour. To whom do I speak today? Brothers are evil. To whom do I speak today? Faces pass away. Every man with face slower than those of his brothers. To whom do I speak today? Hearts are thievish. The man upon whom one leans has no understanding. To whom do I speak today? There are no righteous. The land is left to those who do iniquity. To whom do I speak today? There is dearth of the faithful. To whom do I speak today? There is none here of contented heart. Go with him the apparently contented and he is not here. To whom do I speak today? I am laden with wretchedness. Without a faithful one. To whom do I speak today? Evil smites the land. It hath no end.